you know, I had a, a epiphany. Is that what you call it? An epiphany the other day. I just recently turned 40 and uh, I just recently started working out and, you know, taking care of myself and my body a little bit. You know, I've been neglecting that for a couple of years. So I figured, you know, it's time to kind of get back and uh, start working out, just take better care of myself. So I uh, I made a decision. What? What are you doing? So one of the things I've been doing these past couple of weeks, every Saturday, is that I've been watching Samus do, you know, this the YouTuber, the drummer YouTuber. I've seen him done, uh, up, uh, you know, live streams on YouTube. Every Saturday he streams on YouTube. And he sits there and he's absolutely amazing, super engaging, sitting there playing drums. And, uh, you know, I usually request Pantera songs and he plays them and it's, it's a lot of fun. I've been standing around thinking about what I can do to, you know, just make my life a little bit more active and creative. And it dawned on me. I want to learn how to play drums. Now, why? <laughs> well, you know, one, it's, it's probably good exercise. I think so, at least. And uh, second, I mean, it's it's an instrument that I, you know, I sit and program drums on a DAW. Why, why am I not playing drums? I just want to have a little fun, man. I want to, you know, play some Pantera and, you know, jam some some cool songs and whatnot. I, I just want to have fun. It's not like I'm going to be a professional drummer or anything and, you know, and record all the drums on my albums or something like that. I think it's really important to have these professional drummers, you know, Delta Empire and Kevin Talley for my stuff. I don't think it's bad if I could learn a little bit of drums and, you know, keep myself a little active. So that's what happened today. But the dog is in the way. So what happened? <laughs> I got hold of a drum kit. The Roland VAD 306. So uh, I'm going to set all of that up now. How about that? So I used all the connections I had <laughs> and uh, I scrapped up this drum kit and uh, I had this uh, floor mat right here. So I'll lay down here in, in the stream room. It's not really that, okay, now it's straight, sort of straight. I got an uh, Mapex snare stand and a Mapex uh, hi-hat stand. And then uh, I, I bought a, a stool from like a Millennium Tolman chair. Oh, it's a symbol. Look at that. You know you're doing an unboxing of the E drum kit on a guitar channel when the guy's like, oh, look at that, it's a symbol. <laughs> Ooh, this one says bass drum on it. I think there's like a manual for every part of the drum kit. This is not gonna be easy for me. I'm just as excited as you. Oof. Look at that! It's a... It's a bass drum! <laughs> Holy shit! I guess this is the trigger pad, right there. Uh, I will have a double kick, obviously, because, I mean, I want to be like Dave Lombardo and Vinnie Paul, you know, all those legends. it's on the floor i fixed the, these stands already i also put together this it's uh iron cobra double kick pedal right there that's a dog and it seems like the stands are the same there's two bigger v pads and two smaller ones so i guess it's like uh snare and uh like floor tom and then two uh toms that and then a kick drum i i don't know i don't know anything about drums man well, let's just figure this out. <laughs> There's like uh, at least seven different manuals for this thing, let's just say that. So I don't know where to start. And everything says, read me first. Read me first, read me first, read me first. So where do I start? I, I guess I, I start by putting up the, uh, the different parts of the kit, I guess. What do you say? Mm -hmm. Oh shit. Put it the wrong way. That's okay. Beginner mistake.
Is it supposed to be angled like this? Oh shit, okay. I think you do. All right, so I can't for the life of me get uh, these two, uh, the, the pelts to hit even in this little trigger space right here. So I have to uh, uh, modify the kit a little bit. It says so in the manual, so it's not something something new or weird, you know? Using a drum key, I'm gonna adjust the, the beater head, which is this, a little bit. So it aligns better with the kick drum, with the double kick. I can't believe I own a, a, a double pedal. <laughs> That's uh, so weird. I mean, this is plastic too, so I'm not sure how much I can, how much force I can push with the with the drum screw here, or the drum key. It's called the drum key. Oh, Olaf! Cancel Olaf. He said drum tool, not drum key. Ha <laughs> ha! What a loser! Look at that. That's more centered, at least. There you go. That's pretty much centered as as can be. Look at this. See? You're helping so much. Thank you. So that, that looks pretty straight right there, I must say. Not super straight, but <laughs> good enough for Old England, the Swede. I have it somewhat set up, except that I don't know uh, how to fit the, the hi hat. <laughs> ah, ah. Look at that. I'm doing my best, okay? All right, so I found out that there was a setup guide for this whole kit. I didn't have to read all the individual manuals for all pieces, so uh, great. Now I have to figure out all of this. These are the cables that go to the individual toms and snares and whatnot. Okay, I think that's securely fastened. Then we have these. Oh, hi-hat. Oh, whatever, let's just plug it in, baby. No, no, no. I don't know. Snare. I'm thinking, how do I do this clean? I don't know. Crash one. I mean, they have the lengths pretty much set up as they should be. Very, very confusing. But, I mean, I'm not a drummer. They, I think they like uh, confusing things. Let's just say that. What an absolute mess. But, <laughs> I think it's all set up. It's on right now. I'm getting audio. Can I turn it up? Shit. Obviously I'm not completely sure about the placement. You know, I'm not a drummer. I don't know where to place shit, but I think it looks fairly okay. You know, the hi-hat is a little bit out of the way. I don't know, maybe I have to have a, a real drummer that helps me out with this. But yeah, man, look at this. Pretty slick, if I may say so myself. Take a look at that. I guess, I guess all that's left is just, uh, okay. <laughs>